Hello guys, what's good? What's crack lacking? Good morning, hello, good afternoon, good evening, whatever time you are watching this vlog. Hello from Miami. Oh my goodness, it's so loud. I'm filming this intro on my way to go find some food because your girl is starving. I am so hungry, but I am so happy because this is yet another travel vlog. If you're new here, welcome. If you're not new here, welcome back. We love to see both old and new faces on the channel. Okay, so this trip is a girl's trip, very much a girl's trip. And speaking of girl's trip, I just want to do a quick check. Have you guys watched the Vegas vlog? If you have not watched the Vegas vlog, please go check it out because it's one of my favorite vlogs till date. So if you've not watched it, pause this one, rewind, backtrack, go back on the channel and watch the Vegas vlog and come back and catch up um, on everything that we're gonna be doing on this vlog. I am in Miami currently because we're going on a cruise for the first time ever. We're going, I am going on a cruise for the first time ever. Um, it is my friend's 30th birthday and she's like, oh, I want some of my girls to come with me on holiday. Let's go on a cruise ship. I was like, cruise ship? Babe, cruise ship? Anyways, we're going on a cruise ship. Um, this vlog is going to be so interesting because it is, for me, a new experience. I've never been on a cruise ship before. I don't know what to expect. I am looking forward to it. But I'm going to admit that I'm a little scared because, well, I've never done it before. I'm the first one to arrive. I just got to Miami because we're, we're boarding the ship from Miami. We're spending a day in Miami and then we're heading out um, on the boat tomorrow. The girls, their flights got delayed. So, still gotta wait for them a little bit. While I wait for them, I wanna look for some food because my flight was for 6 a.m. this morning. I left Toronto super early, which means that I'm starving, so. Let's go find some food. Not me finding a Joe and the juice. This is perfect actually. I'm just gonna grab some food to go. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna introduce everybody on the trip. Oh, Motsi, the birthday girl! That's her! That's, her. That's, her. That's, her. That's, her. That's doing! From okay, everybody has to Baltimore, say. Baltimore, Maryland. I know that's right! <laughs> okay, Motsi. Motsi from 12. <laughs> Sorry, from Jersey. Okay, Motsi, from Toronto. <laughs> Oh my god, that is so bright. Um, but yeah, we the girls finally got there. They finally landed. Long story, that flight got delayed for how many hours? I'm gonna say those messages are really nice. They're really cute. Um, three hours and they finally got here. But we're on our way to um, Mickey Beach. We're gonna go relax, have lunch, because we have a big birthday dinner tonight. But now we have some time to burn, so we're gonna go to Nikki Beach and yeah, that's pretty much the plan. I had a very good nap. After Joe and D Joe and the juice, I went back to the hotel and I, I honestly just knocked out. I was so bloody tired. I'm looking forward to Nikki Beach. This is actually my first time in Miami. And I know that when I see people are like, oh my God, I was here first. It's my first time in Miami. <laughs> I've never been here. I'm so excited. It kind of reminds me of Mexico. I don't know, maybe it's because a lot of people speak Spanish. Yeah. So yeah. It also reminds me of it's LA. LA. Yeah. It also reminds me of LA. LA. Yeah. yeah. Anyways, it's going to be a good time. See you guys when we're at Nikki Beach. Bye!
ain't got a clue, bruh. I said five in the morning. I wake up to five for my yearnings. Yeah, and my mind is a warning. Pray to the one you're relying. Two, three, go. Ooh. I thought we were finishing the whole thing. Oh my god. Good morning. No, Moti has gifts for us. Aww. You guys, oh, this is such a cute tote bag. I can't wait to see what's inside. You guys, we have to check out in like 10 minutes. <laughs> you know you people's 10 minutes is one hour. So I said, let me just remind you. Oh my God, Moti, this is so cute. And it said mud. Okay, let's open this. Oh my God, this is so cute. Yeah. It says Moti. Aww. The lighting here is so dark. It says Moti's cruise. Because we're going on a cruise. <laughs> this is so cute. I okay, what else do we have in here? Okay. This is so nice. Ooh, just the I love it on the so cruise. much. Thanks. And then the latest, like, sense of there's some okay. shimmer. I'm not Moti nice. giving us rosé. Hello guys. Hey, what it do? What it do? Um, today is day two of. <laughs> it's actually very hot. I think we can cross. It's day two of our cruise trip, and today's Moti's birthday. <laughs> One time for the birthday, girls. We just checked out of our hotel in Miami because we were only supposed to be in Miami for a day. We are going to find breakfast. Why is everybody so quiet? <laughs> I feel like everybody just went mute. Um, we're going to go find breakfast. So I'm taking the girls. We're going to Joe and Juice because I went there yesterday and I was like, we could just go there today to pick up some food before we head over to the port where we are gonna board the boat. I'm out of breath. I don't know if it's the heat. But it is so hot, I'm out of breath. Oh, last night we went to Sexy Fish. Sexy fish. Mm. We hated it. <laughs> Collective consensus. We absolutely did not like Sexy Fish because I don't know if you On guys TikTok, have been. Dreams because dreams. maybe it was the time we went. And maybe also it was maybe the time we went. We were already kind of tired too. Yeah. Yeah. We're not just in that mood for bam bam bam, like yeah. big music. And, like bang, bang, bang. Yeah. and the food wasn't that great either. The no, the food was the not good. Yeah, the, we didn't enjoy our time. The whole experience. The whole experience was overwhelming. We've been there. Check. Never again. <laughs> Never again. Yeah. Because we really did not like it at all. But anyways, um, Moti made us the cutest shirt. Why am I out of breath? Moti, Moti is making us wear <laughs> matching <laughs> outfits. Matching t-shirts. I am not the blind. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, the t-shirts are so cute. Tisu, Mati, and yeah. I'll see you guys when we find some food because I don't know if it's the heat or I'm dizzy, but I'll see you guys in a bit. Bye. Cappuccino with oat milk, and then I would like steak and eggs. It tastes so good. So you guys guess you nobody have fried with me.
There you go. Thank you.
hey guys what's good quick updates quick little updates so we're getting ready to go to dinner no we're not going to dinner we're going to watch a show what am i saying so on the boats on the ship there are different activities that happen like throughout the day and this evening we're going to watch a show called love and marriage basically it's about like different couples coming on stage to just talk about love and marriage and we saw and we're like oh we want to go we want to go watch that so we're getting ready to go do that and then from there we're gonna go to dinner and from dinner we're gonna go to we're gonna go to the club later on um but i think that's the only thing i can remember now i'm just trying to refresh my curls real quick i am using this thing called dippity do i don't know if you guys can see it but this is what it looks like i got it at walmart and it's just been really helpful it's mousse it's hair mousse it's just been really helpful with my curls. I'm not gonna lie, I thought I was gonna enjoy this hair, but I'm not enjoying it. There's just too much going on with the hair that is just like, I thought it was gonna be low maintenance, but the maintaining I've been doing has been quite a lot. And it is annoying me. It is my first time doing passion twists. And so I'm like, it shouldn't be this difficult to maintain passion twists, but I don't know if it's the boho but something, something is not right. I think Tiso and Matsy are ready because they're here already. That's pretty much what we're doing this evening. Just gonna go have a good time. Have a good time. My experience on the ship so far, I have not had any seasickness. I don't think any of us has. Um, we can barely even feel the ship like moving except like when we're sleeping and it's like a rocking motion. So just think about like somebody rocking you to sleep. But other than that, I think it's been pretty smooth sailing. Let me wash my hands. Are you ready? For some perfume. What do you wear perfume? Say hi to the vlog. Have you seen the vlog? Hey, today? what's crack Oh God. This is my fave. I like to smell okay, sweet. I, I know like all the girls is like oud, but oud is too mature for me. I like to smell sweet. It's too much. Your thirties is it's too mature for you. It's still like a grown lady. I know I'm a grown lady. Don't but I smell spray sweet. in my eye. Ooh, sweets. For my perfume, I am actually wearing. Um, I only packed like mini perfumes, so I'm just gonna mix two of them. I don't even know. This is the. Boys Dargen from Christian Dior. I absolutely love this perfume. I actually um, stole it from my sister. So if she watches this vlog, she's going to know that I stole her perfume. But I, I couldn't bring my own big bottle. And I was just like, okay, I saw that she had a mini bottle. And so I'm just going to bring hers. But yeah, so that is my first perfume. Oh okay, yeah, this one. So this is the Fragonard. I bought this set of like mini perfumes when I was in the south of France. If you've not watched that vlog, go watch it. I'm going to link it up here. It's my south of France vlog. But I bought this set of like mini perfumes. They were like 12. And the one that I'm wearing today is the Rain. You guys may not be able to see it because it is so tiny. But it's called Rain de Coup. I don't know how to pronounce that. But yeah, I'm just going to wear that all over. I love it because it's it's not a very harsh scent so yeah let me show you guys what i am wearing and then i can head out okay so my outfit for the evening is super casual i am wearing this gold top it's from zara it has an opening at the back the opening at the back is so cute it's just like can you guys see that that's what it looks like at the back and then i have just paired it with um, white linen pants I'm standing in the bathroom and it is so tight in here but I've just paired it with white linen pants this is what it looks like together and for my earrings I am wearing Andrea Yama on my earrings my jewelry is a mix of things I am gonna be carrying a purse but I don't know which one yet I think it's just gonna be a small purse but yeah that is pretty much the look and yeah I will see you guys <laughs> when i'm at the show because the girls already they already left me so i'll see you guys when we're at the show bye the most annoying member of your wife's family alan said her brother mike 
<laughs> Agreeing to spend the rest of your lives together, or at least asking to. She always holds my hand. Oh! Great. What did you say? My butt. <laughs> Hello guys, good morning. Good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning. We are in Amber Cove, Dominican Republic today. We have just docked. We've gotten ready because we want to go out into the city, do some activities, relax by the beach. That's basically the plan for today. It is so hot, you guys. Like, I know that this is the islands, I know that this is the Caribbean, but sweating in places I should not be sweating but yeah anyways we just got ready we had breakfast and we're just about to head out um, we want to do all our activities in like two three hours and then come back to the ship because when I tell you guys that we're sweating <laughs> I am dripping but anyways it is so gorgeous it is so beautiful I'm gonna show you guys a clip of Amber Cove um, right now but I just want to say it's gonna be a good day and I will see you guys when we leave the ship but insert clip of Amber Cove. Sigo pensando otra vez Quiero tenerte por tu bebé Besarte el cuello Tocar tu pie Sujetarte el pelo Y pasar la vida Sigo pensando otra vez Quiero tenerte por tu bebé It's really hard today. I feel like I've set out one million times, but we've just been walking around the city. Um, it's so noisy. There's a lot of like cars. There's music playing. It's a very lively, small city. So if you stop at Amber Cove, come down and actually explore the city. Um, but yeah, I think we're about to head back to our dock because we need to be back on the ship by a particular time and it's pretty close so I think we're going to head back to our dock. Our taxi driver went to get, went to get the car and yeah. Woo, what a day. Bloggers in the wild. <laughs> lacking we are in Puerto Rico we're in Puerto Rico excuse my voice I had a time last night last night was so lit 
that I've lost my voice in the process. So yesterday when we got back from touring Amber Cove, we went to dinner. Then after dinner, we went to a show. We went to watch a family feud live show. It was so much fun. It was hilarious. We went to the family feud after dark. So it was like a lot of adult inappropriate jokes and it was hilarious. And then after that, we went to the club. We went to the club. And I can't believe that we haven't been to the club since we got on this ship because the amount of fun that we had, we actually had so much fun. We're there till like maybe 3 a.m. Just dancing and then we met new friends, which was, so, which was also really nice. After that, we all went out, we got pizza and we just kind of like chilled on the boat till like this morning, which was so much fun. But anyways, that was yesterday. Today we have docked in San Juan. So we sailed on that all night and then we got to Puerto Rico at about 10 a.m. Um, and we actually don't have any plans for today. Very much like Amber Cove vibes and inshallah, we're just gonna get off the ship and then when we get off the ship, we're gonna figure out what we're going to do today. Honestly, I'm not gonna lie. I'm not an activity babe on vacation. I don't like going on vacation and having a bunch of activities planned out. It's like one of my biggest nightmares. I want to be able to just feel the city and then just see where it takes me i guess i'm wearing this silk set from andrea yama and i'm um, sorry i'm wearing the silk shirt from andrea yama and my pants are actually linen pants and they are from i don't know if you guys can see them but they're from zara <laughs> look at mosi hey guys how did you get there hey yeah anyways I'm ready. We're just gonna go about town. I think we're gonna walk around old San Juan. I've actually been to San Juan before. I've been to Puerto Rico, but this was like years ago. And it is currently, <coughs> I would say, two o'clock. So yeah, it's pretty much the plan for today. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. I will see you guys when we are out and about. Out and about. Okay, bye. The consumer uh, always is right. Consumer? <laughs> if I go into Toronto, Vancouver, you do same thing to me. You're right. That's it? Absolutely right. I've been moving calm, don't start no trouble with me. Trying to keep it peaceful is a struggle for me. Don't pull up at 6 a.m. to cuddle with me. You know how I like it <laughs> when you love on me. I don't want to die for them to miss me. Yes, I see the things that oh, they wish gorgeous. on me. Hope I got some brothers that outlive me. They gon' tell the story, shit was different with me. God's plan. God's plan. I hope that sometimes I hope. A fun day was had in Puerto Rico and San Juan. Puerto Rico, San Juan. Hey, lady. It's San Juan. San Juan. San Juan. San Juan. I went to the old and the new San Juan. The areas and it was cool. It was expensive. It was colorful. <laughs> and I drive colorful. I drive. I did a good job showing us around. We didn't even get his name yet. It's true. We don't get his name. But it was. It was funny. It was nice. It was a yeah. good time. Now we're back on the ship. Yeah. Gracious. 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 Our first question looks like this. Kids, what do you want to be when you grow up? A cop. What do we... Uh, <laughs> okay, what did you think? YouTuber. YouTuber! Law enforcement on We are trying to 
get to the beach. <laughs> We're trying to get to the beach. The taxi dropped us off at some sketch market and she's like, just walk through the market. So we are walking through the market to get to the beach. So that's it. That's what we're doing. We want to spend some time on the beach today. So he said he's going to hook us up with chairs because the beach is packed. and talk to you guys real quick your girl is quite sick i don't feel well today i actually am in the depth of just like <sighs> cramps and just exhaustion i'm running the temperature i have a rash i don't know what happened but like in the last couple days i've developed a rash my cramps i'm just really tired this is not how i was hoping to end the vlog i was hoping i would end the vlog in high spirits but i'm not gonna even lie to you guys i'm fighting for my life and we're just sailing back to miami i am in the process of actually packing up my suitcase um yesterday i didn't do much i was quite sick i had low energy and so i kind of just rested today is kind of taking a similar vibe where i'm just resting packing now because um we want to give them the suitcases so that they can handle the suitcases for checkout tomorrow just to recap this trip it's been a really good time i'm very glad that i decided to come on the cruise i'm just i'm glad that i decided to try going on a cruise for the first time and honestly it's been very easy like i didn't have any motion sickness i thought i was gonna be seasick oh sorry guys my tummy hurts i thought i was gonna be seasick but i'm not seasick like i'm genuinely okay apart from like other things of me not like feeling well i think that being on a cruise and coming on this cruise has been such a success um i've had a good time you know we spent a lot of time just relaxing going on the different islands and eating and drinking ate and drank a lot on the ship ate and drank a lot but it's been a good time regardless it's been a good time regardless i i'm looking forward to going back home one thing about me is I don't like to be away from a house unless I'm in another house for more than a week. Like, the only time that I enjoy being out of my house in Toronto for an extended period of time is if I'm in my house in Lagos. There's just something about being in limbo and being unsettled and living out of a suitcase that doesn't sit well with me. I like structure. I like stability. And so for me, my sweet spot of a holiday is five days. After five days, I'm like, let's wrap it up. Let's wrap this shit up and go back home. Um, so yeah, we've been seven days away. I'm excited to go back home. I think I'm gonna actually end the vlog here. If you've enjoyed this vlog, please let me know in the comment section below, which was your favorite part, what did you enjoy? I really enjoy making travel vlogs for you guys because you get to see a lot of what happens. Um, when I'm on those trips and on these holidays, so I really appreciate any comment, every like, every share, every subscribe that comes out of these um, our little travel vlogs. Right now, I'm gonna go downstairs because I want to get my luggage tag. The rest of the girls, they are somewhere. They're somewhere on this boat. I don't know where they are, but like I said, I've not been feeling well, so I'm resting because from next week we're back to the hustle. The hustle and the bustle, the hustle and the bustle. I'm gonna end the vlog here, but before I leave, don't forget to share, don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe, don't forget to leave a comment. Tell a friend to tell a friend, tell a friend to tell a friend. Um, and I will see you guys in the next video. All right, bye.
Kiss them in now, cut your eggs out. Twist some ice, but you'll be heavy in my mind.